Last year, it was named one of the best places to work in Maine. Now, Legacy Publishing, based in Westbrook, has announced it's laying off half of its workforce, and just in time for the holidays. Legacy Publishing opened more than a decade ago. It set up shop inside an old schoolhouse in Westbrook. They sell The Total Transformation, a program for parents on how to manage challenging behaviors in children. When we visited in November of 2011, the business was booming, and the president of the company announced plans to expand. At the time, they said, the company had grown from 75 to 150 employees in one year, and there were plans to add another 70 jobs. That was then. This is now. Certainly underscores that while the economy is recovering, it's very, very fragile. Legacy said it has spent millions of dollars on TV and radio promotions over the last decade. The CEO notifying employees this week of a strategic change, moving away from TV and radio and toward a greater online presence when it comes to reaching and engaging customers. The CEO said in a statement, this strategic change has required us to make a significant reduction in our workforce of approximately 50 percent, effective November 6th. All functional areas have been impacted, and all employees have been informed, with the sales and media teams most directly affected. It is difficult to say goodbye to so many loyal and dedicated team members. The Better Business Bureau says the company has a current workforce of 175. Westbrook City Administrator says any time an employer loses a significant number of jobs, it has an impact on the local economy. Those 80 or 90 people who are going to uh, get laid off, come to Westbrook every single day. Whether they live or not, they come to Westbrook every single day. They utilize our businesses. They utilize our services. They're a part of our community and part of our economy. So the corner store is going to see the impact. The dry cleaners is going to see the impact. The restaurants are going to see the impact because these people are here every day. Bryant says he expects the state's rapid response team to get involved here. That's the group that helps laid off employees with unemployment benefits. I did speak with a few employees off camera today. They were, of course, upset, but they didn't really want to talk to us, saying they didn't want to jeopardize their severance packages.